here at the locks. Uh, you can see here behind me here the Lake Okeechobee discharge has been that way since last week when the officials with the Army Corps of Engineers decided to release the water into the St. Lucie estuary because of heavy rain and because of rising water levels. Now take a look at this. This is video of what some are saying are the results of that release. It appears to be blue green algae. Now this video was shot in the water in Port Mayaka. Environmentalists we spoke to last week told us that this year's weather conditions have been similar to what we saw back in 2016 and they feared blooms could return. Well, core officials we talked to last week told us that they will be working closely with agencies and keeping an eye out in case there was any possible blue algae blooms and they would act accordingly. As you know, Laco discharges have somewhat become controversial after discharges back in 2016 caused toxic algae here in the water in Martin County and killing fish, killing tourism and resulting uh, imposing a health risk to some of the people out here. Now, the Florida Department of Environmental Protection, according to the website, they were out at Port Mayaka on Monday taking water samples to try and determine exactly if that is um, blue green algae, toxic blue green algae. We're still waiting for the results of those tests. And as soon as we get them, we'll bring them to you. Reporting live in Stewart, Angela Rosier, WPBF 25 News.